Howdy everyone, it's me once again, the one and only Killer Rodan. And today, as you can see, I'm still continuing my Disney movie marathon by talking about the movies, shows, whatever the case may be, I guess. Whatever. So I just figured I'll just go into another documentary since I've been reviewing quite a few of these anyway. And yes, yeah, it's something in outer space. Mo Mission Pluto. So yeah. I guess I'll just talk about it because mine as well. Like I said, I've been talking about quite a few of these anyway. From this Disney Athon and my previous Disney Athon as well. So whatever I guess. So of course it's, you can get the idea here to try to do a mission here and whatnot to talk about Pluto. And how Disney, Walt Disney himself, got the inspiration for to name that one dog, Pluto. So, like, okay, that was pretty cool. So, yeah, this, uh, talking about some sort of story from Discovery to realization. And, but, yeah, just trying to uh, complete the mission and just discover things about the sort of planets and whatnot. So, yeah, there you go. So, yeah. That's basically the idea. I'm not our documentary about this kind of a thing about outer space. So there you go. So yeah. Uh, so yeah, folks. I can say that this was definitely something. Uh, it, it was. I guess it was. It was pretty decent. I guess. It wouldn't be my favorite documentary, really. Like not really. There are better documentaries out there it kind of feels like it's repeating the same information really it's it's basically what about 44 minutes just hashing and then rehashing and then rehashing it's repetitive with some of its information really if it could criticize it so i don't know folks i can say that this was okay it was all right i suppose and yeah i can't understand as to why this was made don't get me wrong but and yes, yeah, possibly for the general audience, really. Yes, the most movie, the average movie goers, they're not gonna really understand, or uh, I guess someone's aspects of this film, really. So the people behind this will try to water it down for the general audience, so they can at least get a basic understanding of this kind of thing when it comes to science and and uh, going out of space and whatnot. I kind of I, I get it in some ways. A, a lot of people may not understand uh, people who have no background in science or physics so but for those who have experienced this kind of a thing who do know better this feels kind of dumbed down at some points so for anyone that actually does know better for anyone that actually knows a thing or two when it comes to uh this kind of thing the science the physics you know outer space and all that people who actually know a lot of stuff about outer space. So yes, obviously this gonna be, uh, it's gonna feel dumped down. So a lot of information is gonna feel repetitive because of this, because it's it's pretty much the basics of what certain individuals would already know, really. So yeah, if anything, it's it's just okay. This this pretty much is just very okay, I guess. Would this would have worked better with a different narrator? I guess probably sure. But the segments contain the NASA scientists. That's fine, I suppose. But as for everything else, it, need, it definitely needed some tweaking, I guess you could say. So, if anything, I've seen worse. Uh, when it comes to movies in general, it's, I've seen far worse than this. But it, I, I've seen better, obviously. But I just thought it was just okay. It, it was very all right, I suppose. But yeah, I don't know, folks. Um... I mean, I guess you could use this just to waste time, just to have something playing in the background, I guess. Sure. But, uh, I mean, yes, to some extent, it's going to feel like nothing's really explained. Again, if you know, if you already know this kind of thing, of course, it's going to be frustrating because it's leaving more questions than answers. It's about, what, 45 minutes? -ish. It's less than an hour? So I'm not expecting this to explain literally everything, of course, because, like I said, it's very short. Of course, it's not going to get into, in, um, into a lot of stuff. But, yeah, I don't, know, I don't know. I've seen better. I've seen far better than this. It was, like I said, it's very mediocre as far as I'm concerned. But, yeah, I don't hate it. Didn't like it. No, but, again, like I said before, this, um, I'm giving my own commentary over this. Oh, boy. 
point, I'm repeating myself right here in this to the extent because documentaries aren't really my thing. They never were, like, at all. And yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know. I keep, yet I keep talking about them. Yeah, I keep bringing this up over again. But yeah, folks, this was a decent documentary, I guess. I suppose. So, I guess you could, I could recommend it if you just want some noise in the background, I suppose. While you do stuff, and act, I guess while you I guess, uh, washing clothes, washing the dishes, trying to iron some stuff, clothing, whatever, you can use this as background noise, I guess, if anything. But it's alright, I guess. It's pretty alright. But yeah, folks. I guess there's not much else I can say, really. I'm not really a science expert in any of this, either, but I, even I can tell that they could have done more with this kind of thing, so maybe if the narrator actually had done more research, it probably would have been better off, I guess, I suppose. But whatever, I guess. I just thought I'd just cover this because I did see this on Disney Plus uh, not that long ago, actually. So it's something I've been meaning to do anyway. So I just thought I'd just do a quick video discussing this. Just I guess just to get out the way, really. Uh, so yeah, not a documentary. Uh, I'm talking about here. So yeah, it's nothing special really. So yeah, it's it's, it's whatever I suppose. As far as I'm concerned, it's, it's whatever I guess. But yeah, would I recommend this to anybody? Not really, but I guess just just have something playing the background. I guess. All right, folks. I'm just rambling on this point. Just you know, ramble, ramble, ramble. Just just rambling on this point. All right, just cut it out. All right, all right, whatever. So I'll give this film, this documentary, an overall rating. Of a 5.0 out of 10. It's a 5.0 out of 10 because it's just adequate. It's pretty adequate. As always, thanks for watching. Take care. See you.